Hey guys, how's everyone doing today? So today I wanna to show you a cheap way to add an intake to your vehicle if you're not wanting to spend a lot, but you just want to get some more noise out of it, which a lot of people are wanting with intakes since they don't really add any power. So let me go ahead and share exactly what you can do. So a lot of people put an intake system and they cost three, $400 easy, but there's an easy way to do this. If you just want to gain some more noise, it's an easy swap. doesn't cost a lot of money. It's under a hundred dollars that you can do this for. And it'll give you that noise you're looking for. So here's an adapter. It's a really nice piece. It's going to slide right in here and it has a spot for the mass airflow sensor, so you're not gonna get any check engine lights. It screws right into the top of there. And then basically you're gonna put a cone filter on the other end of it. And you can get any kind of cone filter you want. You wanna get a, about a three and a quarter to three and a half inch interior diameter here. That'll go right up to the adapter. And then you use all the typical clamps to clamp it together. And that's basically what you have here. Very simple swap, like I said. You won't get any check engine lights because you're swapping the mass airflow sensor. Just be sure not to get the um, sensor dirty when you take it off and swap it because that sometimes will throw up a light. So be careful just not to touch it when you're swapping it, but very basic. It'll give you the nice loud turbo noise if you're wanting that. Like I said, the cheapest way to do it if you're Really wanting that noise to spend three, four hundred dollars. I mean, it's expensive. This is a another alternative for you. So take the lid off, you disconnect this connector here. You're gonna leave the tray here. So it's still gonna push the air in from the snorkel. Now you of course you're gonna be getting the hot air um, from the engine. But like I said, it's an open filter design, so um, you will get maximum noise out of it. So let me go ahead and put this all together and show you what it looks like. So here's the finished product, guys. So you have the adapter here. You have the mass airflow sensor. Screw down into it, plug back in, and you have the filter here that'll rest inside this um, the lower housing for the filter. Now, if you want, you could zip tie it to it. It doesn't move around enough for any concern especially with that original pipe it has flex to it so you're all good there so it's a really easy way to do it if you guys are interested in this check the link in the description um, i'll go ahead and give you some sound clips and you can see what it sounds like so like i said this open filter design will give you maximum sound so as you can hear it's going to be really loud the loudest shit you can get since it's a short intake with the open filter design And no check engine lights came on. It's an easy swap. Like I said, it takes you about 10 minutes to do. And this is a little quick driving video just to give you guys an idea. So as you can hear, you definitely hear the in intake when you romp on it. You'll definitely hear it and you let off. You'll hear that little blow off sound. It's really impressive if that's what you're looking for. I'd highly recommend it. Like I said, if you're not wanting a closed design, you want it to be loud and you don't want to spend three or $400 to do it, this is probably your best option. So like I said, it's an easy way to do, to swap this out. And then if you want to go to the dealer and you want to swap your old one back in, it's a simple switch. You know, nothing involved here. So again, check the link in the description. Right now, that adapter is $35, so it's really cheap. And then, like I said, it doesn't come with a filter, so you'll just have to get a, a cone filter between three, um, three and a quarter inch to about three and a half. will fit around there, and then you just clamp it down. So depending on what you want, you can get a K and n an off-brand, whatever you want. Um, you know, if you want a reusable one, but it just clamps right to that, and you have a quick little intake, got some noise there if that's what you're looking for. 
Okay, so I wanna give you guys some options so you're not having to shell out three or $400 if that's all you're basically wanting. Um, and this is the way to go. Okay, I appreciate it. Hope everyone's having a good day out there, staying safe. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thanks again, everybody.